Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenner, and we're playing Germany, aka Saxony, here in Europe Universalis 4. Currently at war with France and uh, Styria, again, because, you know, Styria just likes to be at war with us, apparently. And uh, I noticed that we have some special buildings we can do. We can do a redoubt, which increases local missionary strength a little bit, increases the fort by 2, and local defense is by 10. Let's put that in our goddamn... Oh. I was going to say put it in our capital, but apparently we can only put it down here. So, why can we only put it down here? I mean, who the fuck knows? Redoubt in a bruisey. Oh. We can do another one? Interesting. Whatever, we'll just build one. Let's do uh, an arsenal. Local manpower plus 25%. Put that, uh, oh, Neumark. 700. Yep. I like it. And then we have a grain depot, which we can do as well. Special buildings. Oh, I know what that is. It's the special buildings once you've completed four. That's what it is. It's these buildings. That's ah, okay. We'll do a few of those. Not too many, though, because they are they are expensive. Anyway, the war with France goes well. Uh, we just def we just won two huge naval battles, and now we're going to come up and try to win another one. If we can destroy a lot of their navy, we'll be much better off. Much, much, much better off. Burgundy likes us. I wish I could peacefully vassalize you, but you got four provinces, and I don't approve of having four provinces. Uh, what can we do right here? Let's drop a siege and go. And drop a siege and go. Uh, down here, same deal. Drop a siege and go. Actually, do it the other way around. You go there, you drop another siege, and you go here. That works. Uh, you guys... I think we'll just keep you grouped up in case France gets a little cocky. You guys, however, can drop a siege and go kill them. Do I have an extra leader? I do not. I'm at three out of three. Can I spare a leader? You're in French territory. And you're in French territory. Okay, never mind. You don't need a leader to kill Styria. You have my approval to kill them. They have 24 military tech? So do we. But I would prefer to have a leader, but I don't know. Whatever. Kill them all. Let's go this way. It should be a little more sneaky. See if they can avoid that. They probably can't. Okay, so we got an alliance with Spain. Let's keep bumping relations up here. Actually, what are if we went to war, would Spain join us? No. Alright, let's bump relations with Spain. This will have to wait until the war with France is done, I guess. Can't do relations over here. Relations with Switzerland have dropped. Border friction, competitor, desires provinces. God, Switzerland, you're just a douchebag. You know that, right? I think they are aware of how douchey they are. But that doesn't stop them from being douchey, you know? Alright, Aachen can use some help. Some extra love. How's Denmark doing? Pretty good, but they still have us as a frickin' rival. That's going to take some getting rid of. Uh... I bet a marriage would do it. If we get a marriage, that'll... Well, maybe. And a gift. A gift might do it, yeah. Okie dokie. Can we catch them? I hope so. We've got a long way to go to catch that navy. He's already moved back to Holland, yeah. I'll see if we can catch him. We can uh, get him busy by undocking right into his face. That's something we can do. Uh, why don't you guys come over here? Yep. Hey, we caught him. We caught the enemy. Can we kill him? Yeah, we can kill him. We're in the mountains, but it doesn't matter. They didn't die? Really? They're retreating all the way to Venice. Alright. Works for me. They died. <laughs> Spoiler alert. Jesus dies. Oh god, France is invading Cow. Whatever will we do? Alright, drop a siege. Let's go to Ile de France. You're gonna go all the way around? Actually, I'm okay with that. Uh, drop a siege and go to Lyonnais. Drop a siege. Go to Auvergne. Actually, go over here. We'll just kind of block France in so they can't leave these, this uh, region of Guienne. 
We should probably get some access in Guyenne as well. Bourgeois want privileges, lose Diplo and lose the admin. Because the Diplo is more important right now. We're going to need it for the peace deal. Alright, let's... Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. Hold on. I need to drop a siege and move. There we go. Alright, we're in Ile de France. Let's drop a siege and go. Okay. I'm not sure what France is going to do here. As soon as they start moving, we got to be able to respond quickly with this army. So let's drop a siege so that when the time comes, we can run. Run towards France. We should get access over here. Access. They really like the shit out of us. Jesus. Now that we have access, why don't we just go attack them? Oh. End of the month. That's right. Not end of the month. Uh, Autosave. Go. Now they're going to run away somewhere, I'm sure. Or else they're just going to get fucking destroyed. They're going to get destroyed. Oh my god, they're just standing there. <laughs> god, France. <laughs> oh no, you're going to die. Everything's going to die. <laughs> you just obliterate. <laughs> you just stood there. Oh. oh, that was priceless. We have two generals in this stack. Just eating them all up. Where are you running to? Calais. He's running all the way to Calais? I guess he has access through Champagne. Interesting. Alright, fair enough. There we go. So, let's go to Auvergne and Poitou. And you should drop a siege and go here. You should drop a siege and go here. Alright, so he made it to Calais. Now the question is, where the hell is he going to go from there? He's coming directly south. He's going to Ile-de-France, maybe? No, he's going to Vermandois. Oh, he's going to come attack me over here. Ah, okay. Can we get access here? Of course we can. Let's walk right through Champagne. Yeah, he wants to come fight me. Fight, 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 fight. He's going to Rethel. Oh, that works. All of these guys border Rethel. <laughs> oh, happy days. Drop and go. Go. And as soon as he lands, when's he going to land? The 3rd of May. Let's slow down time a little bit. The 2nd of May, we'll start moving. Oh, shit. Didn't mean for that guy to go there. Pause, please. I freaking hit pause. How many times do I have to hit pause for this to fucking work? Oh, I hate the pause button so much. And it says he's moving, but he's not actually moving. He's not showing me a time of arrival. So when are you going to arrive? He's not even moving anymore. Okay. Because we got here in time, so we can go attack him then. That works for me. And my general is on his way up. Good. Yeah, he's pretty fucked. Oh, he's going to go straight to Ile-de-France. Okay. That I can do. Yep, he came to Ile-de-France. Smart move. Smart move. You can just go there. Goodbye, French army. Oh, he didn't die. He still didn't die. He's running back to Calais. Alright. I think I know how to get to Calais. Let's go straight up, right?
Okay, we've taken Styria's capital. Uh, ba -ba -bum. Who's this? Oh, we we control it. Okay, drop a siege and kill them, and go straight to Mantua and go straight to Parma. Just kill all those fuckers, and you're done. Go over there. We'll just make Styria spit stuff out. It's fine. We'll get all those Prince Restored bonuses. I wonder what the cost of Vassalized Stereo would be. I mean, they're pretty big. It's not going to be possible, but I'm curious. Should province, talk to me. 300% of Vassalizer. Wow. Yeah, you're strong. Styria strong. Well, all of France is being sieged at the same time, so I approve of that. Destroying his armies in one day is very nice. Same thing with France's army, but looks like they... Nope, they did die. Finally. Alright, so put the speed back up. Group up, drop a siege, kill these fuckers. And I have nowhere for you to go. I'll go to Prenio. That'll work. And let's move you into Styrian lands. Make him spit out Ferrara, Modena, maybe even the Pope. Does the Pope still have a core here? Yep. So we could reinstate the Pope, that'd be nice. Okay, we destroyed France's army over there. How are we doing on the whole war front? They're down to about 100,000 dudes. And I think all of their armies are Portuguese. Man, I really hope Portugal can throw off the yoke of French burden over here. I mean, this is silly. France is in no position to lead that personal union, but they've had it for years. Our navy go? Where did Portugal's navy go? Oh, they're they're hiding. Uh, might as well just dock up. I don't think there's anything for you to do right now, navy. And you guys can go back to patrolling whatever you were doing. Patrol Baltic. Patrol Lubeck. Patrol Antwerp. And if anything engages us, we have a navy right there. Oh yeah, France still has this tiny little army over here. I forgot about them. Boop, 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 boop. Why don't you kill that army? And then go down here. Oh, hello, Styria. With your 1,000 soldiers. Poor Styria. Every time they enter a war, they're like, Styria's drunk! And then they get obliterated. What is level 4? Level 3, level 4. Alright, split in half. That'll do. Yes, yes, yes. They're in Tyrol. We're in Tyrol. They're in wherever they are. Who cares? Fast forward to victory. Victory! Oh, there's a, there's a Portuguese army in Nice. Oh, that's cute. That is just cute. And those guys died. Very good. Oh yeah, we could go invade Portugal, but eh. Why don't you guys drop off a siege and come up to... Oh, we don't have access. Go to Savoy. And you guys can also drop a siege and go to Savoy. Let's we'll meet up as much as we can and go attack Portugal. Luxembourg has fallen. Fantastic. Go to Savoy. Styria is building 1,000 troops at a time over here. 
And they're sending them all the way around my armies over here to siege Verona. I just find that cute. We will be able to piece them out separately, since this is not the coalition war. 25% uh, is not really enough, but let's start looking at what we can make them do. We can make them spit out Venice, that would be the entire war score. Or we could do Tyrol, for two provinces. We could do the Pope, which would also get Reykjavik, apparently. Interesting. Uh, we could do Anspach, which would be one, one province, yeah. We could do Augsburg, which would again be one province. Let's see, what else is here? Modena. Ferrara. So out of all those choices, I think we'll do everything except the Pope. <laughs> Poor Pope. Nobody likes the Pope. But yeah, that'll get us some more provinces down here. Uh, actually, if we don't do Modena, we could do the Pope. If we do uh, Ferrara and the Pope, yeah, that'd be good. 97%. We'll do that. When the time comes, that's what we'll do. But that would that'll require 100%. So we just gotta get everything pretty much in Styria. In Styria. Dolby Digital Styria. Uh, 200, 185, we're still, oh, we can't. Why are we not improving relations in Normandy? I want to annex you as soon as this war is over. Relations, mmm, relations. Okay, keep on rolling. But yeah, as soon as this war is over, we're going to uh, start the annexation of Brittany and Normandy. And at the same time, we're going to go to war with um, Burgundy in the hopes that we'll have Spain at high enough relations that they will join our side. No guarantee they will, but we'll do the whole enemy of our enemy thing to um, bump it to uh, good relations. We don't need access in Champagne anymore, do we? Nah. We'll hold on to it, though. Our fortress is under siege in Bosnia. Really? <laughs> I'm gonna go hit you where it hurts the most. In Bosnia. <laughs> oh, forever entertaining. Alright, let's go to Cuneo. And meet up and smash. Meet up and smash. Smash Portugal. We're in the hills, but it doesn't matter. Their maximum morale is only 4.6. Our maximum morale is 5.9. And we have way more discipline than they do. It's a slaughter. And they're going to retreat all the way to Liguria. Wow, that's a long retreat you got there. Oh, look, you're dead. <laughs> uh, Alright, now I think we have to start the invasion of Portugal. Armagnac Nationalist. Sure, I'll let you succeed. So we need access down here. Let's stop improving relations with Aachen. Yep, who cares about Aachen? Seriously. Give me access again. And stop setting me as a rival, you little douche. Why do you have me as a rival? I want to be your bestest buddy. We're allied. We have an alliance, but he has me set as a rival. That's so dumb. Should not be allowed. Okay, let's go to Portugal. Let's go straight to the capital. It's going to take a while to siege through all that shit anyway. Actually, you know what? While you're here, go kill this little army. <laughs> then go to Portugal. Yo, while you're here, why don't you kill these guys? Oh, okay, sure. Alright, they peaced out. Let's go to Toulouse. And you can go to Portugal. Works for me. Alright. One more down. Several more to go. Are you fucking trapped? No, you're not. Keep rolling. 
Liege has fallen. Fantastic. And the army is dead. Good. They, they'll build more, but whatever. Liege, come here. Anschbach needs your help. Or Augsburg, that's what it's called. Augsburg needs your help. And yeah, everything's being sieged. Elzis, good. So now you can run to wherever. Go to Ile de France. Any new choices we can do here? Uh, nope. Same old shit. Restore the currency. How's that going? Pretty good. Still got a ways to go, though. A few years. Looks like Auvergne is going to spawn. That's kind of cool. Venice has fallen. Okay. Oh, cute. France is trying to block us from getting out of Venice. Doesn't matter. We can just leave our troops there until the end of the war, and then we can get out for free. Okay, we've made it to Lisbon. Good. Siege away. And Charolais has fallen. Let's take you to... I don't know, there? That's a fucking level 5. <laughs> Portugal is full of level 5 forts. They take a while to punch through. I think we might have maxed out our relations with Denmark. Yeah, we did. Uh, uh, but they are at peace. Let's go ahead and get... Oh, they don't want a marriage, really. Rival attitude. Interesting. I thought we would be able to get a marriage, but apparently not with the rival thing. So we have to wait for that rivalry to go away, and I'm not sure how to make it happen. Let's just improve relations. Oh, we could do enemy of enemy, right? Enemy of enemy. Who do you got? You got the Hansha, me, and Sweden. Oh, we could probably set Sweden as our enemy. Uh, ba -ba as soon as this war is over, we'll look at Denmark. I think we can get him as a vassal pretty easily. Alright, you've arrived. Good, good. Drop a siege. And go. Good harvest. Okay. Drop a siege. And go. Alright, more provinces falling. Good, good. Drop a siege and go. Okay, drop a siege and go. Okay, we can't improve relations with Spain anymore. That's unfortunate, because they're not fantastic. And they, they put me back as a fucking rival. Why would you even do that? Oh. Champagne wants an alliance back. Nope, you're too big, dude. You're too big. Bum, 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 bum. Everything's moving along. We don't really... Oh, go up there. Help up there. Siege all the things. Hmm. Let's take one guy out of here. Give me a dude. Go. We can't improve relations in Denmark. Yeah, we'll have to do enemy of enemy. Uh, I bet we can do it, like, right now. So let's swap out, uh, we'll put in Sweden. Who can we swap out real quick? Just swap out Provence real quick. Put in Sweden. Enemy of enemy, plus a hundred, okay. They still don't want it, really? Rival, minus fifty, we're at a hundred. And 50 and 120. We're at 175 minus 50, but it's only showing 75 instead of 120. 
Why is this not 125? This should be 125. Is my math wrong? 25 plus 50 plus 100 is 175. Minus 50 should be 125. It's just end of the month, maybe? Maybe? I don't know. That's a little confusing. All right, everything is falling. What are you guys at? 66. We still got a ways to go. Oh, all those demands. Apparently the demands have shrunk, or the, yeah, the demands have become less now that uh, the provinces are sieged. I like that. Just keep helping out. Keep sieging. Oh, we discovered a whole lot of shit. Southeast Asia, all right. Hello, Southeast Asia. Cool. Discovering things on Shen Place. Ooh, execute the bailiff or lose stability. Uh, we're gonna have to get tons of prestige from this war, so I don't think we need to worry about that. We lost a claim on Gelray, like anyone cares. Really. Denmark is insulting us. All right now we're at plus 100, but they still don't want a marriage. Uh, and they won't take an alliance either. But they may get rid of the rivalry thing because we're at plus 100. It's possible. Hmm. I wonder why they have us as rival. That's really disappointing. Oh well. We'll keep it as a possibility. They're the perfect size to vassalize. That's why I'm interested. Romania. All right. Might as well hop out over there. Poito, very good. Uh, who needs, still needs help? Barry needs help. But we are out of time for today, so thank you so much for joining me today, guys. I have been Shen. You have been you. Come back next time to find out what the hell happens in this war. Well, more like what happens in the peace deal. <laughs> See you then. Have a good one.